Hi, so today I have a new video for you and it will be a treats tasting video and I got a box from Try Treats and it looks like this and I saw um forgot her name, Sulfrit ASMR making this video and I love food and I love all furry foreign candy or um, treats from all around the world so I asked them and they sent me this box it's crazy <laughs> that's that's possible but I thank you very much for sending me this and I will give you my honest review. I also got a coupon code. I think it's 15% off or maybe 20. Put it here on the screen or in the description box. So I'm gonna open it right now and see what's in there. So I'm gonna open it. So fun. Konnichiwa. Oh yes. It's a Japanese box. That's so exciting. Look at this. So it's a Japanese box from all the countries. I have the Japanese one. I'm really happy with that. Oh my god. These are the treats inside. And there are some things in it I always wanted to try. Oh my god. Um, I hope there's not too much um, meaty things in it so I can eat everything. I'm reading. Big not fried. Sakeru ringwe. Ringo. Um, there are... Um, only um i think there's only one thing i'm not going to eat because it contains um it contains shrimp so i'm not gonna eat that but the rest i can eat so that's perfect and it looks like it has been opened before probably from the duana It has a nice packaging. I guess. I'm not gonna take a look too much, but I'm going to start with this. And I'm gonna take a look what this is. Sakeru Ringo Gumi by Uha A. Sakeru Ringo Gumi by Uha A. Are a gummy candy in the form of a gummy strip that can be ripped, chewy in texture, rich in taste, and unique in its form. We bet you've been seeing this gummy like this before. You've never seen a gummy like this before. Nope, I didn't. I'm gonna take my scissors and cut them open carefully. I think it will be apple flavor. Oh gosh. I'm gonna lay down my scissors. Ooh. They're individually wrapped. Oh, that smell though. Like that. They're all green. So. It's so fun. I'm so excited. That's a Japanese box. It should be apple flavor because it smells like apple flavor. I hope it's not chewing gum. Oh no, it's not a chewing gum. Okay. Because then I would have end with this. Oh. And you can rip it apart, they say. So I'm gonna try that. 
Oh, that's funny. Mmm. It's really soft. Quite sour. <laughs> it's really good. It has a really nice um, texture. <laughs> Looks like this. So funny. <laughs> I want to eat it all, but I have to eat some more, maybe after this video. So it looks like this. It's a really good texture, I can tell you. It's like, easy. I thought it would be hard to chew, because it is like, I thought it would be like those gummy bears that you have to chew for a really long time. Mm. It's just really soft. I'm, I don't, I'm not a candy eater. I'm more of the chocolate and crisps and stuff like that. But this is good. I like that one. It's a little sour. I don't like sour, but that is good sour. Um, then I have Moro, Morokoshi Watoro. And this is... Ah, here. It's a large, puffy corn snack, soft and crunchy with a rich and cheesy taste. They taste like Cheetos, but different. Okay, we'll find out. Have to make sure there's no meat in it. That's interesting. It looks like this. It smells good. Okay, this will be really loud, I think. Mm, they're hot. It says chili. Oops. Those are really good. Mm, I love those. <laughs> so I guess I got a different flavor because here it's a green packaging and that's a red one. So I think I got the chili one. But that's way better than cheesy one because I love chili. I also love cheese, but that's even better. <laughs> this one I'm not going to try. This is the shrimp one, but um, I know some people that like that, so um, I'll give it to them. And I used to love shrimp, um, shrimp chips, but I don't eat fish too, so I'm not gonna eat that. Japanese rice crackers. I love um, rice crackers. This is amazing. I would don't want to eat meat, so liver. What is liver? I don't know. I'm gonna take a look what it says. Um, it says, is it this? Okay. Our golden hued deep fried rice crackers in the shape of a shell. 
crunchy with a light soy sauce flavor. This treat achieves the perfect balance between sweet and salty while retaining an incredibly crispy and fresh texture. So, it's a soy sauce flavor. never cut open a packaging like this. That's funny. Okay, let's try. That's really loud. <laughs> It tastes really good. It kind of tastes like the previous one, but less spicy. So that's really good. Where do you have to delay this time? Okay, so excited. Calipo. I have tried the small ones before. I don't know if I want to open it right now because if I do, I don't know how to store this. But um, I've already tried the small ones, like these ones, and I think or I'm sure they taste the same. Um, and I really love this the flavor of the artificial strawberry. <laughs> also from artificial um, grape. Those two flavors are my favorite from Japanese things. So that's the one, and I'm gonna read what it says. Uh, the giant calipo looks like an ice cream cone, but instead of containing ice cream, the cone contains thick and fluffy layer of strawberry filling and compassing an inner layer chocolate filling. It's not ice cream, but it's just as awesome. I'm glad it's not uh, ice cream because it would have melted. Those are here. This looks interesting. Butter, soy sauce, take well cut potato crisp. By Kiko Man. I think I read. So there's soy sauce flavored potato crisp that look like french fries. They're baked, not fries, and contain less oil than the average fried potato and are crunchier than french fries. I really love the Kiko Man, um, Kiko Man soy sauce. We have that in Belgium, so... Funny. I'm gonna try it. That's salty. That's so good. That's really good. Mm -hmm. You can taste the potato. Also the saltiness of the soy sauce. What do you want more? That's really good. Ooh, I'm gonna save this for less because this is something sweet for a dessert. I'm listening if there's background sound. So that this is Apache melon soda. This is a melon soda flavored cotton candy with pop rocks. So that's cool. I want to try it immediately. I tried the grape one a while ago. I 
I made a video of that. Wow. It feels so weird. Ooh. That's good. Ooh, look at the inside. You hear that? That's good. I'm gonna eat it after this video. It sticks um, at your teeth, but it doesn't make a lot of pop rock sounds, but it's good. Pocky. This is my favorite Pocky flavor from all the Pockies that I've tried. Oh, that was a big one. And um, this is the... Um, it's it's uh, formed in a heart shape. So that's really cute. I know how this tastes, so I'm not gonna try it, but it's really good. And um, it's two packs, so that's perfect. Oh. I'm gonna eat that tonight. Two more things. Kaki no Tani rice crackers. And in Belgium we have like a mix of all these Japanese uh, things. And these are in it and they are one of my favorites in that mix. So I'm gonna take a look. Are crescent shaped soy flavored rice crackers with a crispy and crunchy texture. It's a ubiquitous. <laughs> it's ubiquitous as a snack in Japan. I really don't know how we say that. <laughs> I've never heard of that word. And many people like to enjoy it with a glass of beer. I don't drink beer, so we're gonna try it like this. They kind of look like worms. Ooh. My mom will love these. I love these, but my mom, I'm sure she will love this even more. It's like salty and really crispy, and it looks like worms. So. The last one is fruit gummy candy assortment and it's gluten free so I know there's gelatin in it like there's gelatin in it but um, I try to not eat gelatin but sometimes like I won't buy gelatin myself but I will eat it like right now I'm sorry but, you know. And I know what gelatin is made of, you don't have to tell me. So, this has three flavors. Lychee, mango and strawberry. And I've always wanted to try the lychee one. I have saw it all over the internet and... They smell good. It's also really cute. It's all in individually wrapped. It's not good for the environment, but environment. But look like this.
I'm sure this is one annoying candy that takes a long time to eat. Mmm. It tastes like a real lychee in your mouth. The last two candies I had to move and I'm no I know that I'm not focused but I really want to end this video with this. So I'm going to try the mango gummy right now. And it smells a little bit, I don't know, off, but let's try it. Okay, now I taste the mango. I'm not a big fan of mango, but that's probably why I don't really like this candy. It's not bad, but I don't know. I'm sure people that love mango will love this. And I'm trying to take a strawberry one. This is a strawberry one. I'm gonna try it. It smells like real strawberry, not artificial. It looks like this. Flavor of this one it tastes like a sour strawberry. It's good, but the first thing I don't really like gummies. But I don't know. I love the lychee one the most. So this was really cool to try and um Thank you very much for watching and I hope to see you soon. Bye bye. Sorry for this weird ending and this angle. But thank you so much for watching. Bye.